Well, now an Eyewitness News exclusive. A Philadelphia small business that shot to fame during this year's presidential election got another dose of fame last night. Trang Do spoke with them about their prominent role in a Super Bowl commercial. Good fortune has seemed to shine down on Four Seasons' total landscaping lately. <laughs> The Northeast Philadelphia small business shot to fame in November when then-presidential advisor Rudy Giuliani accidentally chose it as the setting for a high-profile news conference. We were just people, ordinary people, that got caught up in an extraordinary situation. Owner Marie Saravo had been preparing to hand over the nearly 30-year-old business to her son, Michael. But she could have never predicted what would happen next. When opportunity knocks at your car gate and garage door, you roll that puppy up. That's exactly what she did when Fiverr, a company that connects businesses with freelancers, asked her to star in its first ever Super Bowl commercial. We feel so proud that she's in our Super Bowl ad. Um, and so proud that it's really helping her businesses. The ad pokes fun at Four Seasons chance brush with fame. And though Marie had no prior acting experience, she comes across as a natural. The director was so amazing that I'd say my line and he'd say, Marie, I need that a little tougher. I need that a little louder. I need that with a little more attitude. I'm from South Philadelphia. That wasn't real hard for me to do. Is this a mommy? This is not a hotel. While the spot has gotten lots of laughs, it's emotional for Marie, who says it will have a lasting impact on the legacy she leaves as she retires, knowing her company is as strong as ever. Fiverr made sure of that. My grandchildren will remember me when I'm not here. And I'm lucky enough that I have my children to carry on my dream. After a whirlwind three months since that infamous press conference right here in this spot, what's next for Marie? A much-deserved vacation. From Holmesburg, I'm Trang Do, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Marie and family, nicely done.